Darling, a sweetheart, princess, where on earth are you? I still have her shirt, so it wasn't a dream. She's here, somewhere, but I don't know where. Now call the security. If her cute tush left the building, I am going to have some words with her. Security. Yes. Yes, you can cease with the fawning. I'm not going to hurt you. Badly. Where is my darling? I can't find her in the lounge itself, so she has to be in the building somewhere. Task you and your women to find her. If she is not within my arms in the next hour, then I will not be very happy. Understood? Good. Find her. I told her. I told her that it wasn't safe. I told her no. But did she listen? No, no, no. She must play things her way. Everything will be just fine in the Ring of Lust. Filled with perverts and deviants. My little angel, it's way too dangerous for you to be alone just yet. Ugh. I hate this. She should be here. She should be here. It feels so fucking empty in this place without her. No, 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 no. I won't be alone again. No, no. She'll be found, yes. She'll be found. And when she is, she's in trouble. Yes? Oh, you found her. <sighs> she was on the ground floor, and you detained her before she went outside. Ah, good. Very good. A job well done. Take the next shift off after she's been brought here, okay? Okay. There you are, darling. Come here. You are in so much trouble. No, no, no. No struggling. No tears. I told you multiple times that leaving isn't a good idea. And what do you do? Well, go on. Answer me. Ich will an Antwort. Yes, you try to leave the building. Don't you hiss at me. I don't care if you're a royal demon. You do not have the proper training to handle your power. Tell me, do you even know how to use those wings? You do not. Exactly. I am so very displeased with you at the moment. Now then, your wrists and ankles are chained, and I think I'll put you on my bed. Yes. I think that I will put you there for a while. I have a whole host of tools at my command. Your punishment will not be swiftly over just yet. I will make you regret trying to leave. Stop weeping. Hush now. Maybe this will help get it into your thick skull. You aren't going anywhere. You need to learn that listening to me is the only way that you are going to make it here. If it wasn't for me and my girls, you would have been torn to shreds by now. Once you learn how to properly handle yourself, then I will allow you a little more freedom to do as you wish. But you will never leave this building unaccompanied by me. Ever. Shh. You can handle this. You're not human anymore, after all. Your humanity burned away, leaving behind your core, the essence of you. You are stronger than when you were human, and you can certainly take this. Do you know how worried you made me? How frightened I was? I thought that something bad was going to happen to you. So that is why I have to do this. And we're done. Shh. There we go. Shh. 
Mm. Here, I'm laying your head in my lap. Now, have you learned your lesson, good girl? Mm -hmm. Let me pet your head, dear. You've been through a lot already. Shh. Yes, that's right. Just accept it. You'll ache for a while. Consider it a reminder of your mistake. Rest assured, if you are well behaved, then I won't have to do this again. You are precious to me, my dear. I never want you to think otherwise. I did this only because I care about you. Trust me, my darling. It would have been far worse out there. Shh. That's it. That's it. Lean into me. Just let it all out, sweetheart. I'm here. There you go. Shh. I've got you. Yes, I know that it hurts. The whip wasn't too nice, was it? Why, yes, I'm running my hand over you. <laughs> hey, it's okay. Your punishment is over now. You've learned your lesson. Now, who do you belong to, angel? And for the frach. Answer the question. That's right. You belong to me. Good girl. <laughs> Just as I belong to you. Hmm. Your little gasps are so lovely to listen to. Ah. Uh, I'm going to have to hire a tailor to make you some new, more appropriate clothes. To be honest, darling, they're starting to fall apart. They've got large holes, and I can see through them. <laughs> A striking look, but I'm sure that's not what you're going for. So, I'll bring the tailor in to adjust your new outfit to your specifications. Oh, you didn't notice it? That's something I believe. But your metamorphosis has affected you and your clothing substantially. Remember this cute little tail of yours? Ah, uh, yes. It gets a little more sensitive when you rub it near the base of your spine. But here, the tip is a serrated blade. Yours is sharp, meant for stabbing and rending flesh. You will need to watch yourself with it, as it won't discriminate. It tore through your poor little shorts during your metamorphosis. <laughs> yes, we truly will have to replace your entire wardrobe. Ah, uh, um, oh, it appears as if your tail has attempted to pierce my skin. I know you are angry, and your emotions are rather heightened, so I will overlook this for this one time. But make no mistake, you are not my equal in power, not yet. You will have time to learn. Just don't try to skewer me again, okay, love? Okay, sweetheart. Up we go. <laughs> no, I won't be letting you out of those cuffs just yet. I think you look quite fetching in them. Hmm. Shh. Don't huff. I promise to let you out of them when the tailor comes. Into my arms now. <laughs> ah, precious. That cute expression. Divine. I love you, darling. I know you don't accept it yet. But in time, you will share it. You will. We will have nothing but time for that to sink in. And, well, 
Maybe something more than just love. What do I mean? Honey, we're in the ring of lust. I'm sure that your imagination can fill in the blanks. No, oh, don't worry, my love. We have time. And whether it takes a year, ten years, or a hundred years, I will figure out what gets you off. Mm. Cute. How fun. <laughs> oh, that must be them. Yes, I sent for them before I realized that you had left the lounge. Don't worry. As long as you relax, you will be fine. On your own feet now. Don't move, okay? Thank you, honey. There. Cuffs are off. Behave. Ah, hello. Please come in. Yes, I called you in so you can make my darling some new clothes. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Remember our contract. Good. Now then, darling, the tailor will need your measurements. So stay still, unless they need you to move. No, sweetheart, you know it's rude to stare. Oh, so cute. You don't have to apologize so much. Oh, you think they'll look good in that? Hmm, I agree. Oh, what about this? Mm-hmm. What do you think about this tank top? All right. We'll add this to the list. Now for the main course. You know what I'd like to see. Put her in a suit. Mm -hmm. Yes, black with red trim. No, no, don't squirm. The tailor has to remove the sad remainder of your old clothes in order to wrap you up in a new suit. So, be a dear, and don't struggle too much. It tickles. <laughs> Oh, I'm always impressed with the speed and precision of your work with thread and fabric, my friend. Uh-huh, and just like that, you're completely dressed. How does it feel? Flex, see how it feels on you as you bend and walk. Oh, yes. Thank you very much, my dear friend. Your payment... I will contact you again later. Farewell. Oh, why a suit? Well, I think that it suits you, my dear. <laughs> that, and you simply must look your best for our broadcast later tonight. <laughs> of course you're joining me. I want to show you off to the rest of the universe. And it is how I sustain and grow my power. And maybe, with luck, You'll receive some power of your own. Uh-huh. That piqued your interest, didn't it? Of course. You'll gain power naturally by simply existing within hell. Your body acts like a power sponge, especially new souls, alongside me, and you may grow even stronger. Oh, speak? No, 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 not on this occasion. You can simply sit still and look pretty for me. Trust me, the audience will absolutely adore you. But never more than I do, sweetheart. Ecovenul, I love you. <laughs> Meine Liebste, Schatzja. <laughs>